I've got a secret. Buff Del Campo is out of town on business and I was being really good and I was doing all that work in the bathroom. I was doing so good. I was working really hard and I went on Facebook Marketplace because I was a little tired. Found a new toy and I was like, oh, I could afford that. And so I bought another vehicle and it's, and it's so cool. Look at it, look at it. But Del Campo has said before, like, oh, it'd be neat to have a little roadster like that, you know? Hell yeah. Uh, I mean, the closest thing we have is the total loss fire, and it is a total loss. It's never getting, never gonna. And I was like, maybe we could do a body swap, but this car is so little. Like, you cannot wide body it out or stretch it. Like, it's, it's just so little. Check this thing out. It's it's kind of really, really, really cool. Um, it was in a shed for a long time, so it needs everything because I don't know how to buy anything that isn't trash. But, um, I mean, look at this gasket, like how crystallized it is. It's got the glass, you know, and um, it's got the side glass. It's got, you know, the paint is rolled on. It's... It's a Mark III, is what it's called, because see these, these seams. It's the last year, or maybe 71. I, I didn't know any of these things, so I'm still learning. So it was the last year for the Mark III, or the next last year that they made the Mark III. The body is really rough, right? Just got it here. Today, I couldn't show you me bringing it, because it's exhausting and I had to get it out of there. Uh, Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Whoa, the whole motor is here. Every bit of it. It, need, it needs a clutch. And that's why it stopped getting driven, is uh, it needed a clutch. So, you know, the bonnet's here, the glass is here. It needs some stuff. That's for sure. It definitely needs some stuff. But, I mean, the, it's a whole car, and it has a drivetrain. It was a running car when it got parked down. Um, and I've already spun it over by hand. The engine, you know, turns by hand. It's been sitting for 10 years. It'll be a fun revival. Don't, don't tell. It's going to be a surprise. I'm going to get wheels on it. And uh, I'm just gonna do a couple things so that when he sees it, he's not like, oh my God, what did you do? Um, he'll be like, oh wow, neat, you know? I got a big box of parts. There's no top, so I gotta get it, I gotta get a cover for it. But, um, and there's no seats. We're gonna have to make seats out of aluminum or something. I was really working hard on that on that bathroom. It was a really hard work. Okay, so I did it dumb and got an old junky rusty cool car. Sports car. The guy says when you go he said it when you go 40 it feels like 60. It's so cool and it goes around and turns. So I don't know. Hey baby, you like my sports car? You wanna go for a ride? Dun 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 as found condition. Yeah, it's a it's pretty rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was not easy getting her up on the trailer. So, yep, that's, that's how that goes. This is 70 Mark III. That door does shut, as far as I know. It must have rattled loose. Oh, check out the interior. Okay, so check out the interior. I, I know that it's very rough. It's got some cool stuff on it. Like, check out those latches. They're not even that, that might shine up, you know? Um, sp 
Spit fire. Spit shiner. Okay. Check out this mirror. It's so neat. Cool mirror. Okay, and then check out this. Check out the the gauges and stuff. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. It's got a tachometer. It's got. I, I don't think it'll go 120 miles an hour. It's got the key. I've got a title. It's got the transmission. I don't even know what the shift pattern for a transmission for one of these is. You know, the doors are there. The dash isn't all busted up or anything. You know? I don't know. It's, it's pretty neat. Horn doesn't really work. Steering wheel. The center is, is ugly, but the, the outside is... It's been in a garage, you know? It's aged to perfection. Che oh, check this out. Check this out. This is probably... This is probably worth what I paid for the whole car. Check that out, you know? Maybe, maybe don't use that gas. Oh, oh. I'll show you in the trunk. I'll show you in the trunk. Do, do, do. All right, in the trunk, it does have some minor weight re yeah, weight reduction. Yeah. But the the price absolutely was a reflection of the condition. So I got her for really really low low price of guy wanted to, guy wanted to see somebody have some fun with the car does did not have the time or the energy to uh to do that anymore lots of other projects he had going on and i, I do too but this is just this was just too cool like yeah it came off the wheel the the wheels came off the rims trying just to get it straight out of the shed up onto the trailer, you know, and the bonnet is really rough, really, really rough. Um, but I mean, we know how to use some glass. We'll just we'll freshen her up, you know. We'll just freshen her up. What the heck? Have some fun. There are no bumpers. I don't know. Somebody must have. But it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, you know, and it could, it can, I don't know. We'll hit her with a pressure washer and see what the, what the heck, you know? So that, that's, I've never owned anything like this little two door like that for fun. Um, and I think it's worth a few minutes of investing. Um, like I said, I was told that, uh, the whole drivetrain is operational minus a, uh, and he even gave me the parts to, uh, he was going to replace the clutch so he could, uh, the clutch, uh, because it's a hydraulic clutch, and it was the hydraulic clutch, uh, for, like, the pedal that went out, not, not the, like, I don't have to take the transmission out and replace the clutch plate or anything, or at least that's what I'm, that's what I'm going on, but still, the price very much reflected condition if you can imagine how low the price would have to be to accurately reflect the condition. And it, it, it did. I, I, yeah, I don't feel bad because I know how much work is involved. Um, yep, I'm just going to have at it. Maybe uh, Monday I'm going to see if I can find a set of 13-inch tires to just throw on there. I don't know. Well, anyways, don't don't tell Buff Del Campo. It's going to be a surprise when he gets back. Maybe I'll put it in the garage, pointing nose out like that, and I'll I'll sneak. <laughs> I'm going to try and sneak him in there and be like, oh, oh my gosh, look at this, and see if I can uh, not get yelled at for bringing more junk home. <laughs>